I'm making a message today for single women. Why I'm, I'm single and not married yet? Why am I single and not married yet? There are three, there are three, there are three reasons why you are single and not married yet. And even if you get, even if you get married, you're not going to stay married. Because three B's. And the reason why these three B's are very vital. Amen. Because people get married for the wrong reason. Marriage is a ministry. Marriage is not about bumping and grinding. Marriage is not about sex. Amen. Marriage is not about the body. Amen. And the reason why I'm saying that, because the Bible says that a man that find a wife find a good thing and a favor of the Lord. So the reason why you not married because you think that marriage is about a body. Yes. So so you're trying to catch a man by wearing tight pants. You're trying to catch a man. For wearing tight clothes. Yes, there's some men. Amen. Don't 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 think about that. Because a man wanna see you on the inside, not so much on the outside. Amen. Come on now. Cause men, so so some men ain't looking at the body. Hey Amen. They're looking on the conversation that you carry. Because the Bible says, the bun in the heart, the mouth speaketh. So some of y'all women that's still single, you think your body can captivate a man. But your body, your booty cannot captivate a man. What captivate a man is three C's. Make sure four C's my friend and the reason why I'm, I'm lifting this because I want people to recognize that you must have Christ in your life you must have a good conversation make sure you can cook make sure you can clean and make sure you love children And the next thing, my friend, make sure that glory to God is not about the beauty. Because the Bible says, beauty is vain, but a woman that feareth the Lord, she shall be praised. It's not about the brain. Because you got some women that's educated, they so much into their educating, the education. And don't care about nothing else. They're like a peacock. The Bible say, let not the rich man glory in the riches, let not the wise man glory in the wise wisdom, let not the strong man glory in his strength, but it, go, it goes for women too. So don't think it's your body, your brain, and your beauty. No, my friend, because, and the reason why, I'm telling you the reason why, because what happens if your beauty fails? And a man gonna leave you because of your body. You get you get out of shape, my friend. You become obesity. Make sure it's not a it's not according they go to God because of your beauty. Get in a fire, you start looking like a baboon. You start looking like a monkey. It's what's on the inside, not so much on the outside. Because the outside change. Hey Amen. You, you have a lot of hair on your head. You, be, you become bald headed. And start wearing weaves. So it's not about on the outside. It's what's on the inside. Hey Amen. A lot of people, a lot of people, a lot of men marry women that can't cook. That can't clean. And hate children. 
That's why it's important to date. It's important to pray. Just don't marry somebody because they look good. Don't marry somebody because they got a big butt or big breast or big thigh and, and long hair because the hair they have on the head is not theirs. It's, human, it's, it's horse hair. So why I'm not married still or stay married because some of y'all are too easy. Y'all date, the first date y'all go, y'all have sex together. First date, touch your breast. You'll say, excuse me, uh, I'm not a freak. Amen, come on, set your boundaries. Don't give it up the first night. Don't give up. Don't give it up at all. Give it up when you're married. When they say I do. Because if you, if you give it up quick, the man ain't gonna marry you because you think you're gonna do it. You did it to every man that come by. So marriage is not about beauty. It's not about brain. It's not about the body. Beauty is on the inside coming out. Hey man, come on now. And I was watching, glory to God, this, this young lady, she's 41 years old. She stays, she's single. And she work at Kentucky Fried Chicken. And she, she got tight pants on. She said, I'm 41 years old. Listen, my friend, tight pants don't bring a man. Because it's more than what's behind the tight pants. Hey man, it's your attitude. It's your altitude. And it's your acknowledgement to God. Why I'm not married still? Because some of y'all are too easy. Some of y'all give it up too quick. Some of y'all give your cookie up too quick. Hey Amen. It's, it's more to marriage than having sex. Marriage is not, it's not going to the car dealership and, and test drive the car. That's not marriage. Marriage is not going to the grocery store and you say, can I sample that? No, my friend. That's not marriage. That's freakiness. Marriage is about commitment. Marriage is a ministry. Marriage is not about sex. It's not about, uh, uh, no, that's not marriage, my friend. That's about staying single. And if you're having sex, you should not get married. Because marriage is a commitment until you walk down the aisle over the justice of peace. We get a justice and get peace like I did. Some of y'all spend a thousand, ten thousand dollars on a wedding that don't last a year. Or two years or three years, it lasts six months. At a honeymoon, you're ready to split. Why? Because you'll think about sex rather than think about a commitment. Because marriage is a ministry. Marriage was ordained by God. It was not ordained by your country, governor, or, 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 or Supreme Court. It was ordained by God. God said, I hate putting away, I hate divorce. If you, if you are going to get married and you have a prenup, my friend, don't get married. Because marriage is not a business. Marriage is not a piece of paper. Marriage is a commitment. So why am I still single? Because you're too bossy. You think it's about your body. You think it's, it's about your beauty. No, my friend, it's about what's on the inside. Do you have God? Amen. Do you love God? Do you love the word of God? Amen. Your body ain't going to last for a long time. You won't get fat. You won't get ugly. You won't lose your hair. But what's on the inside? Bring on the what's on the outside. Amen. Glory to God.